Hi, and thanks for joining us. Before I begin, I just wanted to say the following. My equipment and room acoustics will be different to yours, so the sound might slightly differ. And sound is a subjective and personal experience. That out of the way, let us begin. Hi, Concord here. Today I'm looking at two speaker cable models from Cord. Cord are a UK company which started in 1984. The company has grown steadily and gaining a reputation that's gaining international recognition. Their cables have won many awards, not just once, but many times. The cables I'm looking at today, the models are both handmade and made at the Cord factory. So I'm going to start with the Clearway X. The Clearway X is handmade in the UK. It's a pretty good entry level cable to upgrade to without spending hundreds. This is a good cable to go to if you're wanting to upgrade from your basic entry level cable. Cord have tried to deliver a good performance at affordable price. The Clearway X speaker cable has won the Watt Hi-Fi Award for Best Speaker Cable 2015, 2016 and 2017. It uses a combination of materials to produce a speaker cable that tries to outperform for its price. You can pay for the cable fully terminated or you can get it per meter. The cable is made with an XLPE insulation which has a three dimensional bond with the plastic and the XLP insulation is a thermoset zero halogen insulation that provides flame resistant properties as well. The speaker cable also uses a 14 AWG multi-strand oxygen free copper conductors the cable's insulation has been upgraded from FEP FEP, to the XLPE insulation, as I mentioned before. The conductors are arranged in a twisted pair configuration with a soft PVC internal jacket. Now this helps to minimize any mechanical noise. Cord have provided decent shielding on the Clearway X, which brings subdued nuances that make music come to life. And this is something you may notice if you're going from a very basic speaker cable and looking to upgrade for a better quality speaker cable. Now, onto the sound. Well, how did I find the sound? I did notice the difference on my system. I find my system good enough and resounding enough to notice the difference. It's Macintosh gear and I have BMW 800 series. But let's put these cables to the test on a system that's around $1,000. Did I notice any difference from going from a $2 a meter entry level cable to the Clearway X? Well, I can say yes, I did. When I started listening with the $2 a meter cable, it was good for a starter system. However, the improvement with the Clearway X was in the mid range and the noise floor. The vocal rolled off far better and it was a bit smoother. I feel these are cables you could keep for some time while you upgrade your other hi-fi components and they would still perform quite well. Now onto the shoreline. Now the shoreline, this is where things get interesting and I mean interesting in a good way. Now the shoreline is based around the Cord Rumor X and has been a favourite for 20 plus years. The conductors are silver plated. Now in terms of insulation, it's in the same kind of family of the XLPE. The shoreline uses PTFE insulation and it's a robust fluorocarbon polymer plastic material that's commonly used to insulate cable to gain a performance for demanding applications. The cable also has a dual layer foil and branded shield that they use on the Cord Epic, which is the next model up. Now, they went with this insulation because they found it to be cleaner and sonically better. Now, you're probably asking, well, how did it sound? How did it sound on your gear? As I mentioned earlier, I like to think my system is good enough and resounding enough to notice the difference. And I tried the Clearway on my Macintosh gear and it was nice and the more I listened, I thought it was a nice, relaxed sounding cable. The Shoreline, I played the same song and noticed a sound change pretty damn quick. Like water flowing, it was smooth and natural and the bass rolled off really nicely and my music was smooth. It sounded smooth. Now, 
just a fraction, I will mention this, and it's only by the slightest fraction. It, it may lack a little bit of detail, just a tiny smidge. And I'm comparing that to my previous cables. However, my biggest surprise was the openness. Wow, the sound stage improved a lot. I felt like my music was floating around and it made me think, what's the Epic speaker cable like, the next model up? The Shoreline, when I first listened to it, I was like, Jesus, am I listening to Dolby Atmos? It honestly made, on my system, it opened things up quite a bit and it really sounded quite nice. Now, what I did like about the cord cables, with hi-fi gear, some components can match up really nicely. Some speaker cables can sound really nice with that amp, and that can sound really nice with that, and that can sound nice with that. And the cord speaker cables complemented my Macintosh gear really nicely. I thought it was a great match. It was producing a really nice relaxed sound, what I noticed was the shoreline was the bass, as I said before, rolled off far nicer than my current cables. And I still like my current cables, but it's a different sound and that's why it's all subjective. The noise floor is great in both cables, most likely due to the insulation that it has. If you were to ask me would I purchase a shoreline over my current cable, that's an easy answer. Yes, I would. Now, Cord also do power cables and power boards also. Now, what I also like with these models is that the Clearway and the Shoreline, as I mentioned before, they're handmade and made in the UK. Really nice cables. I have listened to speaker cables when I worked in Hi-Fi and there's a lot of speaker cables out there that they ask a lot and I haven't been that impressed to be honest, but that's just me. But I'm really happy with the cord. So well done cord. I think they're really nice cables. I'm interested to hear what the Epic are like because I did notice that jump from the Clearway to the Shoreline. And if you have really basic cable, really entry level cable and you're looking to something to upgrade to, the Clearways are probably a, a good choice. So go have a listen to them. Well look, that's it from me. I hope you like this video. Please give me a thumbs up and a subscribe because subscribing will really help out the channel. And if you need some company while you're going to work or exercising or doing whatever you're doing, have a look at my podcasts. They're also available on Spotify and Apple Podcast under the same name, Concord Hi-Fi. And I'm also active on Instagram on Concord underscore Hi-Fi. Thanks for joining me. I'll see you next time.